Hello, Pokemon fans, that's Mr. Hooviews. Today, we're in Pokemon Journey, the series, episode 95. Farewell, the Team Rocket Wanderers. Um, yeah, this, uh, focus, this episode focuses on Team Rocket Wanderers, uh, trying to, uh, well, first they're following the Pelipper. To see uh, who puts the Pokemon in the uh, Gotham machine since in their opinion they got some uh, bad ones which were uh, Slack Off and Slack King. Yeah they blame uh, those two for their uh, failure when they're battling uh, Go and Sosi but yeah I think it's, tr it's the trainer's fault since I don't know that says if a uh, they sort of power, they able to use one big attack. I don't even move that the Jesse and James told the Superman to use was slack off. And then they went back into their Pokeballs. Or would they be Rocket Balls or something? Or, you know. Anyway, they uh, try to find a Pelipper. And then he uh, burst a balloon when uh, they spot a, a saw blue and they try to catch like all three and try, try and he just leave the balloon and then uh, then end up in in the sea and get eaten by a whale lord and turns there's a ship in a whale lord and also a uh, shut off. Yeah, that looks like a real ship. And they want Pelipper to help him out, but... Didn't they see Pinocchio or read it? They could have just made a wait uh, Raylord to sneeze. I don't know, but... Pelipper is able to get him out, thanks to, thanks to using, uh... I think water poles or something, some sort of warm up, but I don't know. And they up uh, somewhere icy where they... Um, no, with a mammal swine, and they don't really show up, but they're able to control mammal swine by putting me out on a fishing pole. And they end up in this, um, uh, um, uh, village, uh, it's not a village, where to me, uh, Cassidy, who says he, does he, Actually, I quit Team Rocket to run a cafe and uh, make uh, wood carvings. Yeah, not only make them and sell them, or just make them. And uh, Team Rocket, or Dutch and James, and that does that work for uh, Cassie for a while so they can appear uh, back for save their life since they would have died in a snowstorm they're in. And they're taking them probably be a good idea to. Stay there. But when I see Pelipper, they want to go off, but then James finds it hard to reveal that she, she wants to stay, but Meow can just know he does and just lets him. Then uh, the two just run up in another village where they uh, meet a uh, butch who has a uh, female Meow and runs a, a bakery. And yeah, he wanted to tell a uh, quit Team Rocket, but just to be him too, and say, like, since he, uh, since Cassie already told him. And once again, uh, the work for Butch, since he gave him some food when they're really hungry, so it's still a life debt. Uh, like with James, Mel got to stay because, uh, the film of Meow Mind on Meowzy. So Jesse and Wobbit go off to find uh, Pelipper and went up and it's dead where Jesse just said uh, tired, hungry, probably thirsty since he's hallucinating Jesse and James, or, uh, James and Meow poking her awake but Jesse is sans through. And uh, Jesse and Wobbit actually Fall into this uh, uh, 
hold of trap hints with Megan and that she was too hungry enough to get out but luckily Jane meowed so up yeah it's really uh, uh, Cassie gave the uh, Jane to can or just booed him when uh, his uh, Morpeko started eating it in the cafe of house and home um, with meow like uh, Meowzy, the female meow that Butch or Boris, whoever owned, was friends with a Persian. Yeah. Before James and Meow can uh, say that Jesse they fall into the pit trap as well. And uh, even Del Pedro says he's not gonna let the uh, you know, it says sight. Yes, yeah, spits it out onto the trap pin to get, the, get everybody out of the hole as it flies off. Not the only thing the Team Rockets had to do is somehow get back home. Lucky for them, uh, Gomes is host here there. And yes, uh, the Team Rockets go something to blast them off and the two are just wondering what they're smiling. And they end up in the factory where they were working at the beginning of the episode. I think it's a decent episode. It's really the first time that that she changed me out or trying to find a a life outside of Team Rocket. I think uh, there was an episode about that in the Dungeon and Pearl series where they met up with the an old uh, trainee uh, Team Rocket grunt and now came a chef in his restaurant and so she wanted to focus more on her coordinating career. And I also in Don Pearl where uh, a uh, person Cassie sold up and Jesse was saying that he swapped up uh, places with them with uh, James being with Cassie and uh, Jesse being with, Bo with uh, Boris but mm. uh, I think it was uh, good uh, seeing uh, Cassie and Biff again I Really thought that James or Jesse would uh, uh, into a bit of a cafe with Cassidy, but I can't say. I think this is one of the times where someone got the uh, uh, what's his name right, but hmm, at least first time Jesse got his name right. Um, the Yeah, but uh, Meowth was uh, comparing the female meow that the uh, Butch had with the Meowzy. It sounds like with a green ribbon on it. It's like a uh, Meowzy. But then have pink. Like uh, the female meow in this. Ugh. And it's been announced that uh, Mar Marnie will be uh, the next opponent for Chelsea in the Pokemon World Coronation series. And I'll be in episode 99. And it's a two parter. So it'll be, it'll be good. If there's some Bill Marnie and her brother Piers. Uh, like everybody else, I think it'd be interesting if he uh, if uh, Tulsi lost to Marnie, maybe build up another uh, female rivalry. Or another rivalry of a female character from uh, Galar, Thorn Seal, whatever. But, mm. And next week, uh, South Korea Focus episode. Uh, I'm thinking that the week after that episode uh, 97 probably be the Slowpoke uh, episode. I really dread that. And episode 98, a lot of people are guessing probably uh, the Chloe uh, EV contest episode, but I don't know. And, uh, I just hope that everybody else is enjoying that uh, Legends Arc is, so I'm not so far, but yeah, I'm just beginning it. So, hmm. Anyway, yeah, that's time. I'll see you guys 